Thomas and Percy are good friends, but sometimes Percy teases Thomas about being frightened and he doesn't like that at all. One evening, he was dozing happily, but Percy wanted to talk. Thomas decided to say nothing and went to sleep instead. Next day, Sir Topham Hatt came to see him. Meanwhile, Percy was moving some freight cars into a siding. Henry arrived with his goods train. The signalman changed the switches and Percy waited onto the siding until Henry had steamed by. Then there was trouble. Percy was speechless. He watched as the other engines went home to the shed. Night time came and Percy began to feel very lonely. It was only an owl, but Percy didn't realize this. Thomas was waiting for his mysterious load at the harbor. Suddenly, there it was. Workman lifted the dragon onto Thomas's low loader and put lights all around it for protection. Then Thomas set off into the misty night. Percy was asleep on his siding and had no idea that Thomas was approaching him. Percy woke up with a start. The next morning, the switches were mended and Percy puffed back to the junction. Gordon was about to leave with the express. Gordon was in no mood for puzzles. Gordon snorted. When the other engines heard the news, they laughed too. But Percy soon found out that he hadn't. And he explained about the carnival. Percy decided to tell Thomas the truth. 